First at five on your news leader, hundreds of people gathered to say goodbye to a hero. Memphis police officer Joseph McKinney was killed in the line of duty 10 days ago. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Greg Hurst. Hi, I'm Stephanie Skurlock. Today, family, friends, police officers, and the public gathered at Hope Church in Cordova to pay their final respects. Our WRG's Ashley Paul was there. She joins us now live from the church with more on today's touching tribute. Ashley? Yes, yeah, Steph Greg, it was absolutely heartbreaking, but in a way it was also uplifting to hear just how much Officer Joseph McKinney loved and was loved and hearing that lasting legacy that legacy that he will leave behind. I know Rusty is looking down on us right now, just smiling with his big smile. This is the smile that could light up a room. And relative Maria Karina Nahara says Officer Joseph Russell McKinney, or Rusty as he liked to go by, not only led with love, but made sure to pass it on to others. He would always be there for anyone that needed it. He would give you this shirt off his back and the shoes off his feet. A great father, fiance, son, and brother in blue even if he liked to pull a good prank now and then. He would also go in and turn your radios all the way up so that when you got in your car and turned on your car, it blew you out of the car. Oftentimes when someone is a practical joker like that, they do it to those whom they love. And that love showed no bounds, especially on April 12th, 2024, the day Officer McKinney was killed in the line of duty when responding to reports of a suspicious vehicle, fighting back to protect his brothers and sisters in uniform, fighting to protect the city of Memphis. He wasn't just a good police officer. McKinney was a good partner. And when you're a good partner, that means you are dependable. That means that when I'm in trouble, you're going to show up. And that's what McKinney did. On that night, when officers called for help, he showed up. And that's how friends, family, and colleagues want him to be remembered. Not for the way he died, but instead for the way he lived. I didn't see him living a sad life. I think he did what he wanted to do, and he did it well. Officer McKinney was buried this afternoon at Memorial Park Cemetery. He was just 26 years old. For your news leader in Cordova, I'm Ashley Paul, WREG News Channel 3. Our community has lost a bright light. Thank you, Ashley.